Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Friday, 20th of October 2023. These trades were shared by AA who's trading Nasdaq CFT. As you see, the macro chart was in downtrend and it reached the static area of the support and the buyers came back and the price got rejected. So this complex pullback can be seen as an uptrend in a structural chart. So using the trading chart, we identified one area of pullback and entered long position based on algo 1 to 5 and manage and close this with profit. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by KZ who is trading S&P 500 CFT. As you see the macro chart is in downtrend and we can see on the structural chart that the pullback got completed and the downtrend channel was identified in one minute trading chart and he entered several sell short entries based on algo 1 to 5 and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you KZ for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Sam or global instructor from Australia who's trading gold USD CFT. As you see the macro chart reached an area of the static resistance and the sellers came back so using a smaller trading chart he entered here with setup B and managed and closed this with good risk to reward ratio and profit. The next trade was taken on NASDAQ and the price reached the static support area and the buyers came back and the price got rejected. So he entered here also with setup B and managed and closed this with good risk to reward ratio on the other side of the channel with profit. And the results of this trade for the day were also shown here. So thank you Sam for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Friday, 20th of October 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ, Dow Jones and S&P 500 futures. If you look at the one hour macro chart, we see that during the global session, the price was fluctuating between the previous day low and close on all eminis and it started to go down to the market. And during the New York market session, initially just retested the previous day close and got rejected and the sellers came back strongly. So I waited for the price to find a point of control and get rejected. And when the buyers came back strongly, around 1.45 to 2 o'clock, which is on this candle here, which shows the rejection of the price from the point of control and the new support. So I took long positions on these few candles and you can see the entry and exits on all e -minutes. And these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts. And the results were positive showing the profit factor of 30.93 with 93% win rates from the long positions taken, with the average win to loss ratio of 2.15, the largest winning trade was $200 and the largest losing trade was around $109. So I hope these trades taken by the PATH system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day and also weekend.